My name is Norman Seraf. I'm the Managing Director of Seraf Partners slash Seraf Strata and our business is predominantly um, new developments, strata management and uh, in the property game. We started doing property development and property sales in the early 90s. Um, we then forged into property development in the early 2000s and in the last probably 14, 15 months we've formed the Strata Arm which uh, has really kicked on and I guess that's where we're, we're kicking some goals there. I think the major reason for the success of our business would probably be the relationships that we've had with our clientele for a very long period of time. Some of the clients we've had since we started back in the back in early 1990. Um, they're still with us today. We value those and um, they sort of become your friends and using your service becomes second nature to them. I think if you can demonstrate honesty in what you do and people feel that you're honest, then absolutely. They will stay with you for, for as long as they need to because they don't have to second guess what you're saying to them. The moment you get caught stretching the story shall I say, or spinning the story, um, your tenure is very short. I think it's important that when you run a business, that your staff follow your lead, not follow what you say. Um, I found that when I was working for people back in the early days. So my staff see what I do. They see the hours that I work and they see the effort that I put in. And it's very hard not to follow that because if the boss is prepared to do what he's asking me to do, then how can I really say no to that? So I tend to, I tend to do whatever they do. I'm, you know, I, don't, I don't ask them to do anything that I wouldn't do. Matter of fact, I probably do more than they do. I've always felt it's important to give back to the community. When we opened the Strata Arm, I decided to affiliate with a charity. I chose Camp Quality for a couple of reasons. One of them was, I have a child. I can't even imagine what it would be like to have to endure to live with a child with a sickness. So whatever pleasure we could bring them by supporting them was one reason. And the other was a personal experience that I, uh, I encountered back in 2004. Camp Quality also look after children whose parents have been diagnosed with cancer. Not a lot of people know that. Um, and back in 2004, I had a scare, and I remember I had an eight-year-old at the time. So I combined those two things, and then met the organisation, and I just think they're a wonderful organisation. And I was quite honoured to be asked to be the chairman of the New South Wales Executive Committee, which I am now, and we just forge ahead and try and do what we can to raise as much as we can for them. In the next five to 10 years, where do I want to take Seraph Strata? Um, we recently, literally a few weeks ago, opened up our first Melbourne branch. We've got three in Sydney, Hurstville, Parramatta and the CBD. I guess ultimately wouldn't, I wouldn't mind being up and down the east coast of Australia, but it's a difficult industry. It's an industry that's non-stop. So um, I guess if it was up to me, I'd like to be up and down the east coast of Australia, but until we master and make sure we stay on top of what we have at the moment, I guess we'll stay where we are.